So my name is Sharon and we are here to experience Grey Goose in its entirety, what it's about, how it was made and how you can enjoy it. Grey Goose is a French vodka and it's a vodka that was created out of a vision of a guy. His name was Francois Thibault. This is a vodka that was created from the ground upwards, that is full of flavor. Grey Goose was created from the wheat that creates the most uh, expensive pastries in the world, which is from France, and it comes from the area called Picardy, which has the most expensive wheat in France. And it is also uh, distilled, and the waters that run through Grey Goose are the waters that are also used in distillation and in dilution of champagne, which comes from an area called uh, Gensac. It's the Champagne region, which is the same waters that are crystal, and limestone waters that purify grey goose. So when it comes to grey goose, it's a vodka that was created basically for taste. <laughs> Me, I like I like the taste of grey goose as it's long go. It's go with sour, sweet, salty. Um, almost almost everything and that's why I create this menu according to the taste of Gregus. We have some items like uh, Mediterranean, like spiced halloum, it, it goes very nice. Then we have some dishes like dessert, we have uh, meat, we have uh, salmon, Chinese item even, it goes very very well. Halloum, it's uh, Cyprus uh, type of cheese, it's kind of salty, like really really salty. So we soak it with Gregus, it, it removes that saltness and give that really nice taste like pita, salty and even less salty. Anyway, we spice it with some paprika, chili, it goes with very well. Then we pan fry it. Uh, now we have sweetness and salty and we need something sour and that's why we use uh, pomegranate. And it goes very well with the cocktail we are using there, it's called Greek Zori. It's only basically also pomegranate juice. Um, usually not of a vodka person, but I really love vodka this time with beer goose. It doesn't burn my throat, it doesn't um, have that usual tasting of a nasty vodka. Drinking vodka and having food on the side are two different things, but mixing vodka and food, or food cooked with vodka, especially Grey Goose, has an amazing feeling right now tonight. So I'm, I'm really loving the feeling that I can eat something cooked with Grey Goose and eat also, I mean drink with Grey Goose um, cocktails. It's been an amazing combination and I think I'm, I'm ready for more. The vodka is exceptional. It's really smooth, unlike what we're used to. <laughs> Basically, it's not your everyday vodka, but when you have it, you will not regret it. It's a really, really good drink. It is, through and through. It was just amazing the pairings and how Grey Goose has been able to come up with a totally different menu at Blue Bistro and make it an experience that somebody should try. And it's a memorable experience. It does not taste like regrets. <laughs> I feel like tomorrow when I wake up, it wouldn't be that bad. I mean, it's vodka, yes, and we will get drunk, yes, but I will not have as many regrets as I always do. So thank you, Grey Goose, and thank you, Bri Bistro.